Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make a beat on Soundtrap really quickly. First, the instruments you're going to need are called Muffled for the drums, Mute, mass, mute Mouse for the synthesizer, Gentle and Hold as another synthesizer, Nevermind for a bass guitar. Now you can find Gentle and Hold in the Rhythmic section in the synthesizers, and you can find Mute Mouse in the Pad section for synthesizers. Now the first thing we're going to do real quick is go into your beats and you're going to make a quick pattern with the kick and the snare. Then you're going to loop it for a really long time. You're going to come into gentle and hold. You double tap to pop into the piano roll. You're going to lay down the note C. Come back out, press the X. Grab this rectangle-ish shape on the bottom. Bring it out five bars. Click piano roll, zoom in with the our magnifying glass in the corner. Make sure that the arrow rather than the pencil is picked. Hold, pull this out for four counts. Double tap in the C minor chord. Then double tap in the B flat major chord. C minor is C. E flat, G, B minor is B flat, D, F. Then we're going to put in the E flat, E flat major chord, which is E flat, G, B flat. Now we're going to take the B flat and move it down to the bottom so that all the chords are next to each other and it sounds good when they play together. And then you're going to grab all these notes and pull them all the way to there. I wanted this to be four bars, not five bars. And then copy that, control C, paste it into both mute mouse, control V, and also paste it into never mind. Control V. We're going to come back, we're going to go into gentle and hold, select it all, move it up an octave, usually it takes two tries for some reason, and you're going to go into never mind, I'm going to move it down to C, takes two tries, I don't know why, and now we're going to take all these chords and have them be half the length of two two counts long. So a half note copy paste. That's just what all I did right there. Those these are the same chords right next to each other. The way that it says clipping up there is because we got a fat stack of notes right here. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna you push backspace and it gets rid of a note you don't want. I'm trying to get kind of a step up and down look. this to go down to the G which is usually the middle note of the E flat major chord and now we're making it the bottom note so now we have all the sounds that we need now it's time to do the arrangement so first I'm going to have gentle and hold play by itself one time through. We're gonna have this come in after that has time to go through twice together like this. So gentle and hold will have a second 
by itself at the beginning to just, you know, show you what the song is going to be very simplified. I changed my mind when I have Mute Mouse started off and then have Gentle and Hold come in later. Very simple. And I, don't, I think it's too soon for the drums to come in. But, we're gonna, but what we're gonna do in the second half is just throw in a hi-hat like that. Just uh, get you prepared for the beat to come in. can do to make that feel like more of a buildup is grab this circle here on the top it says fade in have it come in to about there and now watch what happens and now is the fun part we're gonna zoom in a bit come in here you go up in between each one and do control E now the, what you do for control E is you're just splitting it up so you have all the different sections. We're gonna make four to start off with. Now what you do is you double click on them. We're gonna, cause that brings you here. We're gonna put in all the hi-hats. And we, now we gotta make an interesting sound. So we got I just like to listen and I there's my I can hear what I want it to sound like. So we got the that we're going simple for the first bar. Then I think So first two bars sound like this. And now, usually what I like to do is for the last bar, because usually you think it repeats after four bars. And for the last bar, I like to make something that kind of leads it back into the beginning of the loop. So kind of like either a drum fill or a hi-hat roll or an open hi-hat. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take an open hi-hat, I'm gonna put it here. And we're gonna take out that hi-hat so it leaves. And we're going to do a hi-hat roll right back into the next measure. Start it. We're going to start it. We're going to, let's see how this sounds. Man, it's already almost five minutes. I hate it when videos get long. Quick, I'm going to show you how to do a hi-hat roll and then this clip's going to end. So you zoom in, you highlight, your hi-hats and then you cut them in half control c copy ah <laughs> it ended where i left off is we cut the hi-hats in half control c copy then you come up see that's where they start is on this line right here and so we want this purple line to come after the first hi-hat control v paste now we have all the hi-hats right next to each other going twice as fast. So it's going to sound like this. 
that's cool. Um, we're gonna have, so we got the bass coming in when the drums come in. And we're gonna, let's see how this does. Okay. Yeah, we know how the intro is. We'll start here. Okay, I see what I want to happen. We're gonna move, man, I keep changing my mind. We're gonna move all the drums forward like that. Going to, going to take these, hold up, to have them hold off a bit. Bring over like this. Copy this. Paste there. Gonna have that come in right there. Take this back. Bring it over like this. Copy that. Control V. Zoom out. And this is I'm just arranging the song right now. Because we're making it's just supposed to be a quick beat. I'm taking more time than I thought I would. Control V. Nope. Okay. Control X. What we need is Mm -hmm. The thing is, it zooms in where the purple line is, and I gotta learn to put the purple line where I want it to be. Copy. Control V, V. Okay. I think I've arranged it to where we have a beat made quickly. this pro V for paste and then we'll have that be an outro and we got just really really quick minute long song and obviously you can have things repeat if you need it to I just wanted to make it fast and save And in a second, I'm going to play the complete finished product. I hope this was helpful.